basically this guy knocked it off the park uh, back in Halloween. So he's back with a vengeance in 2022. Seriously, stop. <laughs> I'm having fucking goosebumps right now, mga kababayan. <laughs> oh, you know. <laughs> That's not Eve. That's Lily. You fucking bastard! Ladies and gentlemen, from its studio south of Manila, IJR Productions presents The Intrepid Show. My name is Ian Rinyon, and I'm just going to have this very short recording for uh, the 6th of February 2022. Now, uh, in the past few days, in the past few weeks, I have observed uh, something, and it's absolutely disturbing, uh, even if for someone who is non-partisan or Somehow, somehow undecided in this coming elections, this 2020, uh, uh, this 2022, or this coming May. Na papansin ko lang kasi na parang kung hindi mo ano, kung hindi mo iboboto daw yung ano, isasab yung iboboto mo, friendship over na, ekis na, and all that. I mean, that's really ano, that's really something that I'm very much ano, I'm very much uh, not really opposed to, pero I'm just questioning that kind of attitude. And uh, uh, in line as well with the memes na napapansin ko rin sa ibang mga, ano, sa ibang mga uh, nakikita ko sa social media. So, it's really just, not really, not just too toxic. Pero, minsan naisip mo sa sarili mo, kaya hindi umuulad tong bansa na to eh. Kasi dahil ano eh, dahil alam niyo, alam niyo mga kababayan, sobrang ano, sobrang politicize na nga ng ano na nangyayari eh ano na ano pa pa pinagtatawanan mo pa or hindi man pinagtatawanan pero alam mo yun pinagtitripan mo pa para lang ano para just to prove your point na ano na sabihin natin na walang kwenta tong tao to or walang kwenta tong candidate na to so might as well just uh, just uh, make memes out of him. Now, mga kababayan, wala namang nagpipigil sa atin mag-memes eh. Wala namang nagpipigil sa atin na mag gumawa ng memes. Sa, to- sa katunayan, gusto ko nga rin maging meme lord sa totoo lang eh. Pero yeah, that's uh, that's no longer an option for me who is an alternative media practitioner. Siguro, ano, a little bit of memes siguro pag ano na, medyo Uh, okay na rin yung editing yung photoshop editing skills skills ko pero sa totoo lang I think it's just not right for us to uh, uh, alam mo yun kung, kung alam mo lang kasi kung alam mo lang kasi na ano na uh, nabibigyan mo pa ng platform na nabibigyan, nabibigyan mo pa ng ano ng uh, pagkakataon yung isang tao na hindi naman karapat-dapat sa posisyon na, na ng traction eh pinapatulan pa pa well ako naman wala akong ano wala akong kinakampihan dito I am absolutely non-partisan I am absolutely undecided in this year's uh, in this year's elections and um siguro ang mga ano ko lang dito is two wrongs can't make it right parang gano'n ah ay ewan ko mga kababayan it's just um too tiring kasi nakarinig ako ng mga balita or nakarinig ako ng mga kwento na yung mga friendships, relationships and even uh, and even uh, family ties are severed just because of political ideals, just because of things that uh, uh, that seem to be different from you and it's just a little bit of a stretch or it's just to um, it's really something stupid hindi ako sure sa term pero sa totoo lang nakakalungkot lang na humantong pa tayo sa ganitong klaseng ano ganitong klaseng dichotomy sa ganitong klaseng ano uh, pagle-label na enabler ka or ganyan ka it's not just too fucking toxic it's just uh, 
it just shows that this country is an absolute hellhole that uh, starting Tuesday this week it's gonna be a shit show of the highest order and I can't help but say something like that kasi dahil na rin sa pag-uugali ng ano ng karamihan sa ating mga kababayan you just can't ano you just can't really tell people na mali ka dahil lang may sinusuportahan sila na ayaw ng taong yun I mean you know nakakaano lang nakapanghinayang lang talaga na nangyayari nangyayari pa rin to hanggang ngayon really it's just Uh, really, it really is tragic. Nakakaano lang talaga. Hinahanap ko rin kasi yung isang comment dito na it just encompasses or just very much sabihin na natin ano, sabihin natin ito yung talagang ano, ito, ito talaga yung um, pinaka sentiment ko at ng mga tao na undecided or at the very least trying his his or her fucking best to uh to be civil in social on social media kasi sadly uh this is um this is from a certain uh, from a certain uh individual uh sadly uh, babae siya to be ano to uh, to be exact sadly most of uh the people we see as trolls quote unquote trolls are real filipinos blinded by fanaticism their votes will count and we have to live with fan poll results now uh yung real talk niya dito is that all candidates have flaws and your condescending tones won't con- convert votes now i will be asking uh, her permission to uh, to uh uh quote her for this and uh if ever na no, if ever hindi di ako payagan this recording will not ano, will not be released so uh, kung ano man kung maririnig nyo maririnig nyo tong recording ito it just means that uh, uh, she allowed me to uh, uh, share her sentiments about this matter so yun lang naman ang sa akin I just hope that uh, we calm down and uh, pag-isipan natin mabuti kung uh, kung talaga bang ano talaga bang kailangan ng Uh, wakasan ng isang ano wakasan ng isang pagkakaibigan dahil lang sa nangyayari ngayon kasi on the 10th of May this year when all of this is said and done babalikan nyo din to eh babalikan nyo din yung mga nangyayari dito eh and you would ask yourself is it worth it? is it fucking worth it? na tinanggal yung mga taong to sa buhay nyo and, and, and that's where I would leave you right now So, with all that said, this is Entrepedi and Rinyon reminding you to, at all times, now more than ever, be the salt of the earth and the light of the world. Until then, look alive, stay alive, and as always, thank you for watching. See you next time. Ian out.